Hello everyone, this is Mary Ann and um, in this video I would just like to show you a planner that I have which I purchased from Leng Olan I think it was five months ago but which I was never really able to use but first of all you have to pardon me I'm filming this without a holder or a clamp with my phone so I'll try to keep this as steady as I possibly can so this is the binder. It's a Franklin Covey compact sized binder, which is comparable to the Filofax personal sized binder. And it's real leather, but it's suede. It's a suede finish. And um, I'm afraid to use this binder actually because suede stains easily and you can't get them wet. And um, it's, it's really, uh, something that you should take very very good care of so this is suede it's a franklin covey and i just want to show you the binder because i'm not sure that i'm going to be using this i probably will not use this binder at all but i'm going to keep this because i haven't seen this binder around ever since i saw it first i've never seen anything like it again even in the franklin covey facebook groups um so this i think is one of the rarer Franklin Covey binders so I am just going to keep it and I'm not going to use it so I just want to give you a look this is the binder it has a snap closure and when you open it up it has eight card slots and then it has a pocket here and then another pocket here and the rings are 1.25 inches in diameter and over here it has a secretarial pocket and over here it says top grain leather 22266.290 made in USA and over here it has the Franklin Covey um, logo and over here it has the Franklin Covey logo as well and at the back there's just nothing it's just um, a stitching on there is a detail here like a flap that that covers things like the spine and it's but it's stitched shut so it doesn't open so that's it this is the binder it is it is um, a very beautiful binder it's a sh it's a greenish kind of gray and I think it came to me brand new because when I tried to put a, a a credit card in here they were still some parts were still glued down so I think this binder has never been used the rings are so perfect and they can it, it they can be uh, replaced the rings are replaceable I tried to take it off and it did come off and I was able to put it back with a hex screwdriver so that's it this is the binder that I will never use and which I will just keep If you have a binder that is exactly like this, would you mind placing a comment down below if you're using it and how it is doing after you have used it for a while? Because this is a beautiful binder that I would love to use, but I'm afraid about how it will wear over time. So that's it for now. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time. Bye.